Onion guys, for today's video, I'm going to share with you these keyboard stickers that I bought from Shopee for only 29 pesos. I'm learning Korean language these days, so it will be easy for me to have Korean keyboard for my online classes. Before applying the stickers, make sure that your keyboard is clean so it will stick properly. It is very easy to use. You just need to take it off and put it on your keyboard. So yeah, that's it. Just don't get confused. Make sure that you're putting the right one into each letters. So yeah, we're done. For me, I didn't put the numbers and symbols because it's just the same. So yeah, this is what it looks. I have now the real keyboard for only 29 pesos. So how does this work? Of course, we need Korean language on our system. So we'll go to System Preferences and then click Keyboard. And then click input sources so as you can see here we only have US language for the input sources so we need to add another language which is Korean so all you need is to click the plus sign and then look for Korean so there you go Korean and then to set Korean add so that's it. We already have two languages for the input sources. What we need to do next is on the taskbar, there is a flag. Now US because it was set on US, so you just need to choose the two set Korean. So now you can type using the Korean keyboard. Cool, right? Debug. Change it back to US language. You just need to go to the taskbar and click the US flag. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching.